you can hey, tell Sus. everybody. State champion. Yeah, you can That's pretty cool. So this past season, do you have any special memories from this past basketball season? Mostly, all most most of the season was pretty good, just because of how the team was together, especially like a family. Can you explain that a little more? Oh, um, like we would we would always get along, and every time we did something good, we would give high fives or just tell them good job. And also, if we messed up, they they would always tell us it's okay. You got it the next time, or you could, we um, we could do better, and they would help us out. Each of us would help us each other out. So you're working together. Yes. Do you have any special memories of the state state tournament? You had three games at state. Yes, um, I was I was pretty thrilled that we made it to state and that we won the first two games, which were pretty exciting because that was our main goal to meet the two games to end up to go to state. And then our third one was we left the last two games behind us and we were focused more on the championship to, to pull out a win. Five years from now, someone looks back at the 2015 boys basketball season. What would you want them to remember of this season? Um, I want them to remember how hard we worked for that, to show them that really anything's possible, that if you just put effort into it, that anything could happen. Five years from now, People look back at that state tournament and they look at that picture and there's Jesus Morales in that picture. What would you want them to remember of Jesus? That I was just there for the fun of it, that I was part of the team and I did want the team to win so I did put my effort in there to show them that I was part of the team. What, uh, what can you learn? What life skills can you learn from high school sports? That your friends, some, uh, if you, were, if you turn, do your sports and you really love that sport, that your friends sort of turn into family, sort of they trust each other and you'll always have trust in them. There's eight teams that make it to state. Probably 30 teams across the state. Why Cary? Why did, why did Cary win the state championship? Because we put our heart out to the sport. We always try our hardest. We've accomplished every goal that we, were, we set and we did everything that was thrown at us. You're a state champion. What does it take to be a state champion, or what does it mean to be a state champion? To me, to be a state champion is to uh, do your hardest, that always aim high, and sometimes you'll be up there. That it, would, it does take tough, it does take a lot of work, and sometimes it is hard, but sometimes you have to come with those challenges. What's it like playing with 12 guys, or I guess 11 guys, on the state tournament team? What's it, what's it like? What's your relationship with those guys? Um, it's pretty close. We understand each other, and also that if one of our teammates um, doesn't do the right thing, then it's the whole team. It's not just that one person. Like like Dick said, if, if, a guy scores, if one guy scores on... One of us, he scores on all of us. What do you think of Coach Simpson? He's, I think he's great. Um, he does push us a lot, and since he pushed us, we really won the state championship, and it was all because he told us that we could do better and that we could come out on top if we tried.